This is America's Got Talent finalist Chapel Heart. They won over judges on AGT in a big way in July when they sang an original called You Can Have Him Jolene. This is Simon Cowell who praised them publicly but has a long reputation of saying things like this. I'd phone up the war department, <laughs> volunteer your services because you've just invented a new form of torture. So you can understand why the three women tightened up when they saw him coming at them after the show. I was still just waiting and he said nothing but kind things and I was still waiting for him to say something mean. I'm like, all right, go ahead and say it. Uh, Y'all, we spent 20 minutes talking to Tree, Danica and Devin two sisters and their cousin. These women are joy. For example, here's how they responded when legends like Loretta Lynn and Dolly Parton gave them a social media shout out after that AGT reaction. Literally just screaming. We have been screaming for like the past three weeks. And we probably should be saving our voices, but you know what? Right. With everything that's happened, it's just too much to contain. If you're a fan, let them know with a thumbs up and then let us know who they remind you of. Also, please consider tapping subscribe because there is more from our interview with Chapel Heart coming. Like I said, 20 minutes. I'm Addison Hager and here's what you came to see. Chapel Heart dishing on what Simon Cowell is really like. Obviously like Simon Cowell on the show has a certain persona. I I've got to know, is he the same person in person? Honestly, me personally, I feel like Simon has gotten a little soft over the years. And by a little, she means a lot. And Simon, I, Simon had a son uh, some years back. So I think that being a parent has really, you know, kind of, yeah. right. So like, I feel like now he's like, what if this was my kid? You know what I mean? There's more y'all. In fact, the trio shared something that might surprise you about all three judges. Yes, you're going to have to wait to the very end to see the funniest part. And I think probably over the years he's been known to, to be a fan of groups. And so, and I didn't think about that going in and he was like, y'all know I, this is backstage and he was like, y'all know I love groups. Why have I not heard about y'all? I love y'all so much. It's the new Simon Cowell, you guys. The funny thing is, Chapel Heart say that Howie Mandel is the new tough critic on the show. But in all honesty, Howie was pretty effusive too. There was a moment backstage with all three judges and them. That enthusiasm that Simon showed on TV was very real. You know, Simon was just like, he, and he was so kind. He was just like, I am so rooting for you girls. I love what you're doing. It's so authentic. It's amazing. Chapel Heart returned to the AGT stage on Tuesday, August 16th and we'll need your vote to get to the show's finale in September. One country singer, Drake Milligan, already made it, and Simon was a pretty big fan of him as well. I like the idea of having two country finalists at the AGT finale, so we're going to drop vote links in the description when the time comes. Who do Chapel Heart remind you of? The trio came a long way, for the decision to audition was sort of last minute. It's been an amazing journey that's come with a surprise. Um, I have to say one thing I was not expecting, Howie and Simon and Sophia are a lot shorter than I thought that they were. I, I mean, to be fair, all of us, we are all like pushing six feet almost. But... Right. So we're like five feet, five eleven. <laughs> so everybody's typically kind of short, but um, I think that it's, yeah, Tree's always fascinated by how short people really are in real life. And people are always like, Wow, we didn't know y'all were so tall. <laughs> I'm Addison Haker for Taste of Country. Thanks for watching. And as always, thanks for subscribing.